there you go all right we're coming in part two ladies and gentlemen if you just stumbled upon this video okay this is a profiling of the video of this uh, of the beloved brother big judah atlantean tradition in ancient britain which is we knew for a fact all those high technology all those like advanced technological race were our people were the children of 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 yahweh higher okay this is us those gentiles has nothing this dude just admitted he said yo i thought i knew everything but uh, when when i get older i realize everything coming from the fourth part so all praises to the most high yahweh the heavenly father in the name of the holy spirit the earthly mother sanctifying yahweh shai the holy son honor and respect to the chosen and the grafted brothers and sisters jews and gentiles alike <laughs> welcome this is your humble servant big levi and today's sunday october the 18th 2020 and it's currently 8 59 9 o'clock this is part two all right let's finish where this dude was because i can't make uh this part an hour uh because this computer is gonna become a hell of a lot slow so um i highly recommend this this uh video by brother um lda here shalom shalom brother okay go watch this video okay he testified was when the mosai was setting him in order when the mosai pull him out of the gutter and then clean him and make him holy again go watch that all right let's get uh let's take some of those things out so they want uh okay so bro the brother read read something about the the druids in here uh let me see uh boy it's it's a little bit difficult for me to find it uh, okay i believe that's what it was okay uh the remember i told you the the beard okay the golden beard that's a brother right here he was a a, a, a beard a a, a a dweed a magician a merlin okay he was like a quote unquote a moses like person okay so it's, it's just a title all right we are we are dissecting we're going to see where atlantis this is not a theory this is facts this is you gentiles cannot come over here in our channels and tell us oh th this is like a making wish thing this is a theory no we are we are speaking facts we are know where our lane is we know where, what we are who we are what we had okay you're not gonna come over here and telling us like oh it's over there in rome and whatever we know where it is it's exactly right here in america and uh, uh, um in the fourth part this whole damn land is a part of it and it's sucking right here and the the, the ruins is right there this dude he's gonna tell us where the ruins at all right we're not gonna take any hits from you about your opinion your opinion doesn't matter here humble yourself and cleave on to us all right let's move in you can see that you are a little bit of a little bit of a no, man, no, man, avec you say, man, people, ah. say we and the Jews are the same, quote unquote. The Northern Kingdom, he he's going. To, I mean, the Southern Kingdom. He was explaining when uh, in Second Esdras uh, when uh, Father called. Anyway, let's go. Deal, ben mon kabitu avem ki kon lim kontan de narazio na televizion. Lorsque les Juifs étaient en captivité à Babylone, he said when we were in captivity in, in Babylonia and stuff, and then uh, the Jews can they keep, they make two call on and the northern and the southern. So the the northern kingdom left, the southern kingdom you know stay, but they were all scattered. A again, everything happened here in the fourth part. It depends where you you want to put Babylonia, and we know for a fact Babylonia, Babylon is nowhere in the Middle East. It's nowhere. He, he will say this. He said they, 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 anyway, let's, let's, let's move. Okay, let me see. Uh, okay, let's see. 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 Let's Je dis un et lui Anthony Dauphin, c'est une et qui va pour aller pour joindre les ruines de l'Atlantide. So today, if I want, if somebody want to find the ruins, like the 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 genuine, the authentic, the original ruin of Atlantic, with proof, not some theory, with proof, like tangible proof, something you can show people, they can touch, they can see. Where can we get that? Ça vous d'affaire. What can we do? Like, like, uh, as a researcher, archaeologist, scientific. Okay, like the scientists, the archaeologists. Where, where do you, where would you tell them to go to find the real Atlantis, like the real ruins of it? Okay, the ruins, brothers and sisters. Real sense of your knowledge and all that. 
et je me pose des questions. Je me smile when you when you ask me that question because this is the meat of the video. This is the meat of everything. Where is it? Where is the not theory? This is straight up facts. All right, just like the brothers bringing books, we are bringing facts. All right. Gone. En 1986, en 1986, okay, in 1986, there was a group of scientists that did a, 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 a research, that did an expedition in, in Mount Sinai over there in the Middle East, in the third part. Mm -hmm. They didn't find no trace of the Mount Sinai, brother. Big Judah wouldn't do this, brothers and sisters. Elder I hear we went into this and said they didn't find nothing over there in, in the Middle East. There's no place of the Mount Sinai over there. He says everything happened here. He said none of this bull happened in the third part, okay? <laughs> this is beautiful. Now this year. Okay, he said they didn't find nothing in, in that desert over there in uh, um uh, in, in the Middle East. Donc rappelez-moi then le l'actuel pape de François dit Jésus parfait. Vincent de Sam. He said one of the Pope, uh, I think uh, the Pope Francois, said Jesus, <laughs> yeah, Yeshaya, Yeshaya wasn't born December the 25th. Not only that, he said not only that he Jesus Yeshaya, Yahusha Yeshaya wasn't born in that place you guys said he was born he was born here in the fourth part he was born here he said this is strong this is a very shocking truth but we have to we have to say it but to detail you okay we have to give all the details exactly he said the the basin the sea that you are calling the mesopotamia mesopotamia is not over there it's over here it's called the atlantic um, ocean The, uh, uh, the the Mesopotamian basin is a, a actually the the Atlantic Ocean. That's what has happened, brothers and sisters. None of this crap happened here in the third part. It happened here, on the fourth part. Okay, what you are calling Mesopotamia, um, uh, over there in the Middle East. Technically, he's just said like, hey, yo, man, why? <laughs> uh, let's see the name of this sea. The Arabian Sea, um, the Gulf of Aden. Uh, the Red Sea, uh, the, the Persian Gulf, you know, the Mesopotamia. He said, no, all those, they just, you see, this Gentile, they stole everything from us. Then they stole the name of our sea, the, the Black Sea, <laughs> the Gaspian Sea. You know, he said, none of this, man. They did the research. You know, those, those the high scientists that have PhD and all this stuff, they did the research. And none of those stuff, they didn't find none of this uh, over there in the Middle East or, or whatever you want to call this place. You know, Israel over there in the Jordan in, the, in that desert. He, he didn't say in, in, in that desert. They didn't find nothing because it didn't happen there. To say, you see, all of this happened here. Okay, and this dude trying to interrupt him. Oh, it happened here? Oh, why? It happened here? Jack. In Haiti. Tout ça passé ici. He said, it, it told him everything is happening here in the fourth part. He was like, who? In Haiti? He said, it happened here in the fourth part. He's, the dude told you what you are calling Mesopotamia. It's actually here. It's called the Atlantic. It's in the fourth part. It happened on this side. This lane that you are looking at. This part, let me show it to you, bro. Let's get that freaking land over here, man. He said everything happened here in the fourth part from north to south. Over here, it happened here, brothers and sisters. Okay, then you know our people, man. You know how they do. He said it happened here in the fourth part. All right? He says it happened here. There's a reason when he said Atlanta, Georgia, and Martin Luther King, the descendant of the Atlian, uh, Atlantean, you know, he said it happened here. This sea that you are looking at, this is the true Mesopotamia. Babylon was somewhere the, around this coast. Brother um, Little Moray went into it. Okay, um, UB News, they show that Babylon, what, what you're calling Babylon, is nowhere near in that, in that desert. It's somewhere on New York, on the, on the East Coast. Okay, it says it happened here. It says everything happened here. You know? Mm -hmm. He said the 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 sea, the Atibonis sea which is in in, in um uh, in Haiti, um where well, well, we can find that uh it's somewhere around. Uh, it's somewhere around. 
Oh boy, it's it's a big it's a bigger sea. It's like the fourth. It's the fourth sea of the Garden of Eden that flow. That's why when when the Most High say he, he told um uh, Abraham look from the Mississippi um river and the river that used to uh, flow in Atlantis. I'm, I'm, I'm giving you all this land because all this land is connected to that massive land that uh, 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 um, um, underwater, which is going to rise uh, according to what it says. And this land, all of it, <laughs> you know, he said that that's what he, that, it happened in the fourth part. Mm -hmm. Say when you take the, 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 the little city called Abricot, Indian to the party terrace. You see the 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 Indian that was over there. The 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 our people call it the 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 earthly the earthly heaven, the earthly paradise. That's what they call it. Vrai. Which à is true. Où, où and Dieu vivait parmi les hommes. And that time when God was living with us, that's what our land was. That's exactly what the brothers been saying. All right. Et dans la Bible, dans la Bible, Dieu vivait parmi les hommes. Mais c'est tout ça pour ça que de tal est à que ce domaine où moi c'est que tu he yeah. said, that's what I was telling you, Sodom and Gomorrah happened here in the fourth part, in that place that I just told you. Yeah. That's what I, that's the thing that I keep, the, those guys, you see, you really cannot discuss knowledge with somebody like that, that have no knowledge, because they're going to keep tripping you. You told the dude in the beginning, like, yo, everything happened here in the fourth part. <laughs> he keep asking you, where? Like, where? What is the fourth part? Huh? It happened here. You mean Georgia? Atlanta, Georgia? What is that? Huh? What is this? Then again, he come up with something. One of those king. Get out of here, man. All right. Okay. So now the ruins. He's going to talk about the ruins uh, where you can find exactly. Uh, I don't want to go all the way into this. You know what? Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. So he says something that uh, one of the three uh, kings that when you see Yahusha, Yeshaya, Yasha when he was born, stay somewhere close in this area. He, he said, That's what I heard. He said, I mean, come on, Negro, that's not what you heard. I say this. He said, I say this. They don't want to give me credit. I don't give a uh. That's why he said, Je m'en fous. I don't care. But it's the, I care about the truth. All right? Okay. He say, say, I will sometimes when I say things, people don't want to give me credit. They want to come up like, just like the Gentiles. They want to come up like, hey, we come up with this. I don't care. I don't care. He say, Melchizedek. Okay, brothers and sisters. He say, the priesthood of Melchizedek. Okay, Melchizedek. All right, but but we know it as Melchizedek, you know, which was a a, a priest of God. Du côté de 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 Abrico. He said he came from that little paradise place, okay, in Africa. On nous rappelle Abrico, Melchizedek, c'est le roi de Salem. He said he was the king of Salem. We we didn't have no mother, no father. Like that's that's <laughs> that's a metaphor, okay. Uh, Melchizedek. You know, when Abraham, when the war happened, when King Og actually got captured, please see the book of King Og. I got it on my channel. When they captured Lot, King Og, and uh, King Og of Bashan, and everybody, and then Abraham and his servant went and, and delivered them, and then he met Mel 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 Melchizedek. He met Melchizedek, which was the priest of the Most High, and he prophesied to Abraham that Yahweh Yeshaya, Yeshaya is going to be born and save the nation. You cannot discuss this with somebody that has no knowledge of this. They're going to keep tripping you, man. This dude pissed me off, man. And then he came and fought of Abraham, you know, he, put, he, he gave like gold, uh, frankincense, myrrh, perfume, cologne, and then all the precious stones. Mm -hmm. And then he announced the birth of Jesus Christ, the birth of Yahweh, the birth of Yeshaya, the birth of Yahashaya. I don't care how you say it, but this man is telling the truth. He says it's happened here on the fourth point. <laughs> you know, this dude keep up telling him where exactly this is the problem i'm having how the hell you first of all the gentiles hide all the information when you told somebody that happened here in the fourth part okay give me a specific place where like where 24th street 125th street in harlem what is it what is it give, give me a specific place uh, you are lying you don't, you, you don't know anything <sighs> Everything is connected in the Bible. But this is then again. This dude asked him like, "Where did you get this knowledge?" 
He said, where'd you get? How, how do you? Technically, it's like, you're too stupid. How Only white people can tell us, like, where this knowledge is. Say, where'd you get this knowledge, Neil, nigga? Where'd you get it? And the information, sir. Where, where'd you get this information? Hey, boy. The, he, he, like, he a little bit unconfirmed. It was like, yo, really? It's like, when you're talking to, like, I don't want to say stupid people, but when the, when the most I have it open up somebody's eyes, he like, uh, uh, he said, is, 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 that, is that important for me to telling you? into answer you tam dit spectateur en tout cas que monde ka faire recherche monde qui connaît ap ça beaucoup connaît you say you see i'm only speaking for people that knows the people that have the knowledge the people that have the holy spirit to them they will understand where but it's just, if you did know you will know this is the story of the bible from Joshua in the bible you will know that you, you wouldn't even ask him but he tripping the dude put like stumbling block in front of him but he can see them like yo is that really important you use dumb ass mole of <laughs> You know, whatever, dog. You know. He say, he say, the one that needs to know, they'll know. The one that knows, no. That's why he say in the beginning of the video, he says, Hosea 6, Hosea 4, 6, or Hosea 6, 4. My people is being destroyed for the lack of knowledge, all right? He said, this is not important, man. This is not important at all. He said, he say, what question do you have for me? Question Atlantic d'abord. Prenons le prenons le cas des de grottes. He said, okay, now he called him off. He said, all right, let's talk about Atlantis, man. Now the cave, brothers and sisters, this is how the Holy Spirit works. Okay, I made this video called the Lane of Shame, part one, and I also make part two. Okay, this is the Lane of Shame, where they say the cave, the crystal technology, underwater realm, tunnel, and pyramids. Everything that I bought in this video, he just confirmed it. Okay, watch the lane of shame. The possibility of underground, uh, the possibility of underground lane, hollow earth part two, caves and technology. The possibility of underground lane, that the, the lane of shame is part one, and this is part two. He just told the dude, he just cut him off. He said, okay, all right. Now, if you want to find the ruins of Atlantis, if you want to find the real Atlantis, like tangible stuff, tangible proof, This is what I have for you. What your science can study? What is the speleology? He said, like the, the the caves. You have to go to the cave. The science that studied the cave. He just said the name. I'm not gonna going to butcher it. Okay. Enfin, avec la, la he said it's it's different from archaeology. Speleology, so more than spe speleology, speleology, whatever st the science that studied the the cave. Speleology. He said it's it means cavity, like um 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 hole that study holes in cavity. Alors que archaeologists will know that archaeos means ancient. And then he said like a, uh, the the science archaeology archaeos, which means ancient. You know that study ancient. Archaeology is the science that studies the monuments, the vestiges, the monuments ancient. Okay, and he going into French. You are speaking Creole and switch to French. Today. Archaeology is the science that study the monument, the ancient monuments and stuff. And then he say, if you want to see true ancient monuments, here's where to go. Okay, the caverns, the the holes in the places. That's what that whatever the scientists just say study. Au début de l'humanité, l'homme vivait. Et et c'est en 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 le beginning en le beginning of uh, the world, the man was living and then they start living, um, you know, in cave Adam and the cave of treasure. See where it's where it's at right now. Thirty four, thirty four. Here we go. Heureusement, son l'église catholique qui souffre à pas vivre. Okay, all right. Okay. Entre elles, la grotte. Uh, c'est the the cave of Port Apiment. The cave of Mary Jane. Mary Jane and Port of uh, uh, Port of Piment. Remember, I told you there's a cave in Kentucky. There are many caves you can access this area, brothers and sisters. That's what I told you that 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 cave over there in Kentucky. Wherever they don't want you to go there because they know what's in here. I believe somewhere in Kentucky, brothers and sisters, help me out there or Carolina or whatever, because you can go through this cave and you walk underwater, and then there's a temple under the sea. All right. You can you can go and seeing this, okay? All right, <laughs> brothers, this is the information is mind blowing. All right, when he said this, all right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where we at? Okay, that that cave right here. I show this in all my videos. It's situated. They can't really show you, but it's right here. That's why, brothers and sisters, 
when the most high permitted if we have money we can send an expedition of our own people okay consistence on me or the brothers that want to help the nation we brought the money the resources and we will go into this cave so we can bring tangible proof if the most high allows it i pray on this this uh, this afternoon i said the most high god yahweh father listen to me I received this information from from you. It's time for us now to prove the, to the to, to the nation physical. We already proved spiritual. We connected uh, a physical. We connected the lanes. Now we are going to looking for he hidden lanes. Okay, this is a hidden lane. I pray on that. I say, Mosai, allow us to have a, a, an expedition, just like uh, I pray on uh, for the bro bro brother Big Judah and Elder Ahil to build that uh, little place not a city just a little town a little place for us to worship okay a little physical place for us to come get together when there is a feast day just like we used to do back then nothing big just we want to make the effort but i pray i say uh, father allow us to to get a little expedition a so small main team we'll go there we'll come back with tangible proof with video visual audio and, and tangible proof that the people can touch, such as books and, and um, uh, artifacts. You know, okay, they say the, 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 the cave is somewhere around here. See how this mound, Ma this mound look funny. Look at this. Look at this mound, how it look like a pyramid. It look funny. It look like a pyramid. It doesn't look like the other mound around him. They all lose, looks misshapen, but this one, you know what, let me put a pin on this, man, so I want yeah i'll put the pin on it and call it mound pyramid oops pyramids for french okay all right this mound look funny i don't know what's in there did something just jump on me and tell me to put the pin in here this is really really the 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 shape you can see the shape right here it looks like a a pyramid or whatever i say the, the 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 thing is right here uh the the entrance of um uh, of many entrances brothers and sisters you know he will explain to you because like i told you um uh and our father abraham left records how to travel underwater fast how to teleportation there you go they, they left records probably those records are here probably those records are under those caves all right he just talked about that Let, let's let's finish up what he's saying sorry i'm rumbling and stuff all right where, where we were et premier grotte explore ma prédiction en grotte Marie Jeanne c'est la grotte tout bon dieu vis à vis tout diable OK he said this this um this uh, this cave over there it's the it's the it's the cave that situated next to the the cave of god and the cave of devil the cave of devil uh, and the cave of god is like face to face but unfortunately in the cave of the devil on the cave of god there is a catholic church <laughs> Dans la hauteur de Pont de mon côté la croix Saint Joseph. Dans la croix Saint Joseph, il y a des fortes des trois avions. Fort côté cap pour la mort et pose. Ah, he's giving here a little there. A little. He's talking about our ancestor when they fought. They, when they when they fought violently like superheroes, the people they were astonishing about their strength and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. Action heroic en face. You know, a heroic action. Here a little, there a little, just for people who could understand. That's what Isaiah say. He's following the the steps. C'est un bel et de bel. Okay. Malheureusement, c'est une église catholique. Say the okay, like bad luck for us. There's a Catholic church on top of it. Again, like Brother Big Judah bring out of the the books what they do. Anytime they see our monument, our pyramids, they be they build churches on top of them. So you have to know this all over South America, all over North America, all over the world, everywhere that we got um like like places they build a church on top of them or giant cities. He said here, right here in this place called Port Prince, there is another subterranean city under there. He said in, in Cape in Cape Haitian, there is another uh, uh, subterranean city there. In Fort Liberté, oh uh, boy, where's that? Somewhere around here. Ow, I, I lost it, but it's somewhere right here. There's a um, there's a, a a thing under there, okay. And we already know over there, and uh, um um right here, there are many under there, are many, uh, especially in California. 
There's an article that came in like back in the 1960, 1960s, 1920s that they found a very complicated sub on the uh, uh, under, uh, uh, city and they said belongs to Little Lizard, Alien, whatever. Don't look into it. It's fake. Uh, fake, fake, whatever. And you can hear the conspiracy theorists say somewhere in Denver, Colorado, the, 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 the airport in Denver. Where is Colorado right here? Uh, what, I mean, Denver is in Seattle, Washington. Okay, oh boy, I suck at this. Oregon, oh boy, Washington. I'm not quite sure where it's Denver Airport. Let me look for it. Denver International Airport. There is a reason for that. They are building the big, the biggest airport. Oh, Denver. Where was Denver? <laughs> boy, I was looking for Denver. What what state? Colorado. Is that Denver is in Colorado? Where, where is Denver? Yes, Colorado. <laughs> Why well, was going all the way over there and uh, um, whatever? So they said under under the airport, there's a, a hidden city. Okay, the conspiracy theories, but I don't like to mess with those things. There is a reason why the biggest airport in the world are in Georgia. And then he told you in Atlanta, Georgia. Why? Well, you see the biggest airport right here. Is that the airport of Atlanta, Georgia? I believe is that is that it let, let me look for it Atlanta Hart, Hartsfield Airport I believe that's the biggest airport in the world uh, oh I, I passed there you go if I'm wrong brothers and sisters please correct me okay so you know that it's it's not a coincidence that the biggest airport in the world is atlanta atlantis and the, he he said the 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 triangle so under atlanta airport probably there's something there probably somewhere there's a cave that you can go you can see the the ruins of, of, of atlantis he said it's inside of the cave remember in my other videos i told you some of the caves you cannot go there they won't let you in and he said those people can't go in there because it's 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 technological and most importantly mystical spiritual that means you have to be us in order for you to travel there i believe i already explained that in one of my videos. Mm -hmm. okay he's giving a little history so you can so you can locate it, the place that he's speaking here a little there a little you explore it he said that was the first cave that they explored over there. What is the most important for my opinion? The most important um, cave, in my, in my own opinion, is the. Okay, he said the the most important um, cave. That's why he's gonna tell you where you're going to find physical ruin of Atlantis, including their temples. You see that movie Godzilla? Okay. <laughs> Uh, we're not gonna pull any any visual because they're striking me hard, man. He said the the uh, <clears throat> excuse me, the cave is somewhere around right here or here, okay? Toti e Antoine Salgado dans les hauts lieux sacrés d'Haïti parlé de. He said uh, in in a, in a specific sacred place, spiritual place, places like you people can't go, but we can. He said the cave or or, or basin um, is okay. All of the um the the caves they have some type of consent in them. They have some type of um quote unquote some type of awareness in them. Mm -hmm. When you go inside of this cave, you will see the the whole of the sun. He said, you will find the statue of the goddess Amaniola, an Atlantean goddess. It says, when you get there is a specific place you, you enter, you will find the statue of the goddess, of the Atlantean goddess Amaniola, which is made entirely of gold. It's la déesse des Atlantes. It says it's a massive, uh, um, or uh, it's a massive, made of massive gold, and then he's like six feet or something. Three feet tall, three feet Okay, six, it's a six feet tall, three feet long, of gold, pure gold. 
When you walk, or you keep going further inside of this cave, you're going to find a solar temple, brothers and sisters. Okay? Ow. Oh, give me a second. Ah. Oh. Ooh, that crimps. <laughs> My feet. It's crimping. All right. Um, a solar temple. Just like the Mayan. Okay, just like the... Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, the bristle of my hand is in everything. Anyway, this is the type of picture that I'm looking for. You'll find those type of people. This is beautiful. Thank you to the Holy Spirit. This is the goddess Amaniola of, uh, of, uh, of Atl Atlantis. All right? We'll take this picture. Again, when they say goddess... It means a hero person, a, a person of figure, a, a person of a respected person. All right? Okay? Uh, uh, it, it doesn't mean something they worship. It means like a hero person, somebody that is very important to us. Okay? You'll find her. Okay? The, the goddess or the princess Amaniola. That's her name. Amaniola. I look for this word. I can't, I can't find it. See, the priests of Mahan, they know this. See, the moment you put a solar temple, next thing you know, th this is all priests of Mahan. Initiation, there's an initiation going on right here. Another initiation right here. Templar solar. When I'm looking for something like this, okay, you're probably going to find this statue in there which made uh, entirely of gold. He just told you where you can find it. All right, let's move it. <laughs> Un temple solaire qui illumine 24 heures sur 24. If you will find a, a, a solar temple, a, a sun, a sun, uh, um, a sun. Oh boy, what's the proper word for a church in that case? Uh, well, it's like a sun worshiper, a place they worship the sun. There's a proper name for this. Uh, a sun, a solar temple. Yes, but there's a better way to say this um whatever but a solar place a solar t of worship where well, it's quote unquote for worshiping the sun but the sun over there is shining 24 7 20 the sun never set in that place in that place that you find okay he said which is situated exactly he giving you specific location brothers and sisters i don't know is he lying i don't know okay the only way for us to find out if it's true is only if, if we can get an expedition going over there, which is quite cheap. I'm praying on this. Let's pray on this. If the Mosa allow it, we can go over there, take pictures of this statue. We'll take a, a physical evidence and bring it back. You know, but it has to be us. We're not going to land it. Oh, Gentiles go over there for us. Okay, guess what? They can't go there. They, they would not, they do not have the access to go there. And he will explain to you why. He says, I'm not talking hash. I'm not pulling things right off my ass. You know, we, we're joking with the land. He said, you guys are playing with the land. This is a very sacred land. We got very sacred hash over there. He said, you guys are messing with the land or messing up in everywhere. The fourth part, this land that we have, right, this is a very sacred land. And that's what I always say. You see, it's, it, you say, this is not the land. This is the dude was saying, like, okay, it's, it's the land or, or, or Atlas. Whatever, man. 24 hours. And he gives a specific uh, uh, location. I mean, I'm not talking. I'm not talking here. If you want to go see, it, go see it for yourself. You know. He said that little island, Haiti. We're playing with this. This is a very sacred land. He caught him off. It's a land of the Atlan, right? He said not only it's a, it's, it's the the Atlantean land, Atlantis, but. Mm -hmm. Tout homme de tout journaliste, tout leader politique a dit ça et grand devoir avec ce destin, mais il gagne ça avec le destin, c'est pas même politiquement, nous on côté non pas aller. Damn! This is the most important part of the video. He said not only it's our land, but we have a destiny, brothers and sisters. Pay attention, he said we have a destiny. We have somewhere, we go, we're going somewhere. 
Okay, which is uh, let's see. Oof, I, oh boy, I'm gonna have to make part three. <laughs> part three, we're going to go into the um the precept, but this is gonna be the most important part right there. Part three. All right. So he said we we not only this, but we have a we have a, a, a destiny. We have a, a, a specific things that are going to happen. The the divine switch. That's what he said. Mm -hmm. it's, not, it's not it's not fighting yin yang yin yang the, the uh, you know the twins it's not killing each other fighting it's none of this bull opposition of guma with president it's like the opposition of fighting the government you know that whole bull, the back the back hole going over there you know like like he technically tell us it's not camp versus camp it's not me it's not how you say it yahweh shy yeshaya jesus christ it's not gonna be about that brothers and sisters that's what he's talking about right here Say, say, we have a specific destiny. We have a specific world, a specific place, a de specific destination. That's what he told you. He said it's prophesized. It's going to happen. It's already happened in the spiritual realm, in the mystical realm, and it's going to happen in the physical realm right now. He said the lane is a sacred lane. The fourth part is, is, is the lane of God. It's sacred. All right. It's something you cannot touch like this, like that. So, so you can't just put, just because you heard us saying we're going to uh, put a little expedition and then go looking for the real ruins of Atlantis, then you have the money you decided. Anyway, if you are a chosen Gentile, if you are a Gentile, period, you got the money to found it this, email me. My email is in, in, uh, um, in, uh, in the description. Email me. The Most High Father will bless you. You'll be part of history. You'll prove what hasn't been unproved. What's, what's been unproven. What has been saying impossible to prove. Okay? If you have the resources. If you have the materials. If you have the money to fund this. So we can go, uh, um, go ahead and make this uh, official. Email me. Oh, there's a... Yeah, the, the, they really don't want that information to get out. There's a humming there. Uh, I can't stop that humming. Oh boy. There's a humming. Ah, you demons. Whatever, I'll speak through it. It's a land that have a place it's going to go. Isaiah 60, verse 22. Isaiah 60, verse 22. We're going to stop here. We're going to pick up. Because he's telling you, <laughs> straight up from the Bible, say, amen, this is prophecy. Amen. It's going to happen. Let's uh, take part three, all right? I'll see you folks in part three because this thing is going to run slow. <laughs> 